वेलकम टू अदर वीडियो व्हाट आर टॉकिंग अबाउट टुडे वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट एआईपीसी सो चैट जीपीटी स्टार्टेड द एआई एरा सो टू से इट आल्सो फोर्स अ लॉट ऑफ कंपनीज टू रीलुक द वे दे मार्केट देयर प्रोडक्ट्स फ्रॉम सर्च इंजिन्स ऑपरेटिंग सिस्टम्स टू इवन चिप मेकर्स अ न्यू इंडस्ट्री वाज बोर्न और शुड वी से new marketing buzzwords were invented now looking back even up to 10 years ai was always around us intelligent routing in google maps auto complete on google search or even youtube for that matter heck even the way netflix suggested movies we have always had a digital spouse who butts in to complete our sentences and let's not forget all the social media algorithms which are pretty good at reinforcing our biases in the content presented and now even in the comment sections There are plenty of resources to suggest that AI has been influencing consumers and products this last decade. Netflix has been fine tuning how even thumbnails for movie suggestions are updated according to your viewer profile. And that's just scratching the surface. So in all of this, we find ourselves bombarded with messaging on AI PCs, AI on mobile devices, on your operating systems, the works. The question arises, why? Hmm, paise ka chakkar hai baba bhaiya, paise ka chakkar. So what do these AI enabled operating systems, chips and services do? The short answer is not much really. Stuff like this has been working on our devices for over a decade now. Now the long answer is slightly complicated. Earlier most of this AI magic used to happen on the cloud, which in itself has been quite seamless the shift has been subtle and has been taking place for the last 5 years simple stuff like predictive text input on your smartphones categorizing images by face location types and events now the big shift that's been happening recently is the promise of running smaller sized pre-trained models on your desktop and phones now the chip design has changed to help this neural engines tensor cores and what not a decent nvidia gpu in your system can help you generate images locally allows you to chat with your files and search for information within your system and ask questions and microsoft has been updating their os to have more and more of these ai enabled features so is this really old wine in a shiny new model absolutely yes it makes me wish i was still a kid homework would have been so much easier now the feature set for these computing devices is only limited by our imagination we are not far away from the day when programmers would code simply using natural language now imagine a world where complex programming happens just by dictation working without error or flaws imagine the changes to curriculum careers and even industries exciting times ahead a quick postscript to this video if you would like us to demonstrate how to get chat with rtx working running local llms on your pc do comment so that we actually end up making that video thank you for watching have a good day